right, thank you. A Fresno couple received an invitation of a lifetime to be guest of President Biden for the signing of the Respect for Marriage Act. Last week, the House passed the act enshrining federal protections for same sex and interracial marriages. Now the couple is sharing their decades long journey for justice and marriage equality. A milestone moment on the House floor. The motion is adopted. Last week, in a rare show of bipartisan solidarity, Congress passed the Respect for Marriage Act, the legislation enshrining marriage equality into federal law. The bill now heads to President Biden's desk for a signature, bringing peace to many couples across the country like Robin and Karen McGeehee. The more that we can do to solidify our rights and be equal citizens, um, in our community, the better. Robin McGee spent most of her life fighting for same sex equality, and that's why she received an invitation to be a part of the historic moment. They said, you know, we're calling from the White House. We'd like to invite you to the signing of the Respect for Marriage Bill. President Biden's going to sign it. On Monday, the two traveled to Washington, D.C. to stand in for LGBTQ families from the Valley. Robin and Karen have been married for nearly eight years and have two kids. You know, we're two women that love each other. We're devoted family members, um, um, raising kids in the Fresno area. And, you know, our marriage should be no less valuable than the family that lives right next door. This has been their life's work from rallying at Fresno City Hall to the nation's capital. In 2010, Robin was arrested while in front of the White House protesting the don't ask, don't tell policy. During her journey, Robin has met with key political figures like civil rights activist, the late Congressman John Lewis and Vice President Kamala Harris. This moment isn't the end. She plans to continue her fight for equal rights. But we can't just stop at LGBT politics. We've got to start looking at how to be better. I love the mayor's one Fresno. We've got to think about how to love our neighbor and be better community members and make a better community for everybody. 12 Republican senators and 39 Republican representatives, including David Valadeo, joined all Democrats to pass the Respect for Marriage Act. President Biden is slated to sign it into law tomorrow.